how do you start a spaceship when you don't have the fuel for it? How do you get your vehicle running when you don't have what fuels it? The fuel that runs this machine, where do you find it? This is my experience in the studies and the practice of my rage, of my feelings, that I tapped into a source that was able to power this experience and power this body to do the things that I didn't think it was possible. Your anger and your feelings are the source for this machine to run. They are the source for empowering, empowering you. What I've learned my whole life is to not use those sources, to stay away from those sources and to use them in a secretive way, in a way that is not obvious to the outside how I'm using it. So my anger, I use it in a way that is okay for society to use it in this way of punishing myself or persecuting others for what they're doing or for the, the wrong things they are doing. And I've been using my anger in this way my whole life in a, in a way that it doesn't power, empower my experience and empower my, my purpose, but it's something that it keeps me in the status quo, in the normal, yeah, like uh, I feel pity for myself and I, I, am, I suck and I'm not that good. And, uh, and these people, they suck too because they're, they're f fucking up this thing. They're, they're really doing it wrong and messing up the, the world. And this is the normal way that I've learned and that I've experienced that anger is commonly used around. And what we are gonna explore here in the sounds of rage is how you can use your rage to empower your experience and to use your anger in a way that if for if it creates a, a you tap into the source in a way that you tap into your own inner resources for navigating your life for creating the things that you want to create for saying yes and for saying no for saying i want this and i don't want this for creating your boundaries, for getting to know who you really are underneath all the programming and conditioning that you have put above your anger and above your feelings. How do you run this machine, your body, without these resources? How have you been running it your whole life with only like, 5% of what you are capable of, with only this 10% of what, what you are really capable of running this thing. And what is possible when you tap into your resources and are able to use those resources for delivering your value into the world, for changing the things that you want to change in the world, for bringing the things that you want to bring into this world for using your voice for a way of creation, for a way of really like bringing your value and bringing this passion of being alive, being present with all of your feelings, being present. This is what your anger is for. This is what your rage is for. And this is what we're gonna be doing here in the sounds of rage, using your anger to be present with all of your feelings, with your fear, with your sadness, with your joy and being present using that source that is from within you to navigate your life and to create distinctions that can really shift your perspective from what you knew to what something else is possible. This is your space for exploring your sounds and your feeling of rage, the sounds of rage. Thank you.